In this video, I introduce uh, adaptive uh, instance normalization for image style transform. The deep neural network can encode both content and style of image. If the style of uh, and the content of uh, image are separable, we can change its style while preserving its content. The style transform method can combine content and the style of uh, two images to synthesize a new image. Given an uh, input batch here, batch normalization normalizes the mean and the standard deviation for each channel in this formulation, where gamma and beta are learnable parameters for each channel. Mean and the standard deviation are computed on each batch by using these two uh, formulations. Instance normalization is uh, defined on each instance in this formulation, where mu and sigma are computed for each channel by using the two formulations here. Gamma and beta are learned to transfer style from one image to another. We can also learn gamma s and beta s for a set of styles as in this formulation. During training a style image with one fixed style S, I use the as an input. Adaptive instance normalization uses content X and the style Y as an input and aligns the mean and the standard deviation of X and Y in channel wise. Adaptive instance normalization has no fine parameters, gamma and beta, and the instead adaptively computes the fine parameters from the slow input, where sigma is a skew factor and the mu is a shift factor, which are computed from the feature map of the style image. Style transfer network uses uh, one content image and one style image as an input to uh, generate a synthesized image here. Adaptive uh, instance and normalization layer uses a feature map as an input after convolution, we get a new feature map, and then now we use this uh, mu x and the sigma x uh, to normalize this uh, feature map, and we use this uh, sigma y and the mu y to uh, scale and uh, shift uh, the feature map. Style transfer network T takes a uh, content image C and a uh, style image S as an uh, input the encoded feature maps FC and FS are fed to adaptive instant normalization layer here. So the new map T is computed from adaptive instant normalization. A decoder G is trained to map T back to the image space. Last function is defined as sum of two terms, where LC and LS are the content and the style losses respectively. Style transfer network process uses this content image and the style image as the input to generate encoded features FC and FS. Adaptive instance normalization uses a master input to generate a map T. And the decoder uses T as an input to generate a synthesized map in the feature space. This allows function I use to train the model. For more details, please check with these references. Thank you. Bye.